Rhea jokes often about her, her memory. It's not so great. She uh, often jokes about how she does puzzles to try to strengthen her memory. So I thought, what better way to celebrate tonight than to toast to memories? So tonight, for the memories that we do remember, it's because we're here in the presence of true love with family and friends everywhere. And for the moments that we don't remember, we'll blame on the alcohol. Please raise your glass and we're gonna toast to Mr. and Mrs. Matthew Aramian. First day, first kiss, first time that I felt like this. Matt, the day that we both have been waiting for has finally come. You are so many things to me, my rock, my support, my best friend, and so much more. Bria, I am so excited to be in this next chapter of our lives together. I knew very early on in our relationship that having you beside me for the rest of our lives was going to be a very easy decision for me to make. So on this special day, let's take the time to look around, take it all in, and see all the love that we not only share for one another, but also all the love and support that we are surrounded by. So right, so close, that's how I hold you. We have all come here today not only to join two people together, but to recognize that such a joining has already taken place. This commitment that Matt and Rhea made very early on in their relationship was readily evident to their family and friends long before we gathered here today. Their love was something different, and everyone they came into contact with could see and feel it. One of Bria's favorite memories was Matt's first phone call, which she quickly hung up on him and called her friend to ask, who does that? No one makes phone calls anymore, they text. <laughs> a marriage is the most fragile relationships, but is also the strongest. Remember that this ceremony is not only a symbol, a celebration, this is your marriage, and yours to make real, and yours to live. I, Rhea, take you, Matt, to be my husband. I take you, Rhea, my best friend, to be my wife. I promise to love, honor, and respect you. Through our strengths and weaknesses. Good times and hardships. With patience and understanding, now and forever. Now, by the virtue and authority invested in me, I pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. About two years ago, Matt sent me a text. He had been talking to this girl, Rhea, uh, and he was super excited to introduce her. Now you have to understand, Matt doesn't just introduce girls in his life, so this was obviously a big deal. So Jill and I had the pleasure of meeting Rhea for pizza in North Kingstown. She was pretty, funny, and normal. So needless to say, we were confused. You brought up the best in Matt ever since the first date and this is truly the happiest I've ever seen him in our 20 year friendship. Because these are the best of our days. Woo! These are the best of all our days. Woo! These are the best of our days. Woo! These are the best of all our days. Woo! So let's spend a little time together. While we're losing a great third wheel, we're gaining an even better fourth, and we couldn't be more thrilled. We're here today because we know how special you guys are for each other. Some would say you are the yin to each other's yang, the tea to each other's crumpets, and the bangers to each other's mash. And I had to get that English joke in there, I really had to. Um, but I speak for everyone when I say you guys are great for each other, and how happy we are that you found each other, is, it's really great. So, it's been amazing to see your journey so far, and it's only just begun. Here is to many more years of happiness, prosperity, love, and starting your happily ever after. <laughs> <laughs>